Hello procrastinators and welcome to Minesweeper. Yes, Minesweeper. I've decided to play this game that comes with almost every computer ever made since the dawn of time. Uh, I The reason I'm playing this is not just because I'm bored and Steam isn't working. Um, it, generally, I get emails constantly about will you play Minesweeper why is Minesweeper your favourite game? Because in a old video, Christ knows which one, I stated that Minesweeper was one of my top five games of all time. I will state now that that was a joke, because Minesweeper is one of the worst games ever made, and whoever made it should be thoroughly ashamed of themselves. If you don't know what Minesweeper is, you click on these grids, and you attempt to find not bombs like that. If you find a bomb... Whoops-a-daisies, you and your family die, and then you click play again, which probably isn't showing up. I doubt Fraps will pick up on that. Oh, well. So you do a click, uh, and these numbers correspond to... And it's amazing how many people who don't know how to play Minesweeper. It's really weird. Like, everyone's got it, and no one knows how to play it. It's kind of one of those weird little things. Anyway, these numbers respond to how many bombs are in the grid around that thing there. So this has one. As you can see here, there's only one thing here. So that's probably a bomb. If you right-click, whoops, uh, and if you don't, if you right-click without having giant sausage fingers that make your mouse move when you're trying to click, you can plant a flag there, and now you can't click that. So you're basically saying that there is a bomb there. Uh, this square here won't have a bomb in it because this one here is a one. So there's one bomb in this area. It's there. So that's not going to have it there. This one uh, also won't because that is a one that that bomb is there. If you hold down left click and hold down right click, you create a square like that. If you let go of that in an area that you know is empty of bombs, like say this one here, it will just open up that whole area, so you don't have to click everything. So proper players do this a lot faster, they just right click and then do anything like that. If it comes up like, uh, let's see that again, that, that means there is a mine in that area. If there's only one, that, that means that is the mine. So that lets you, just left clicking and right clicking lets you dig out mines wherever they need to be. The reason Minesweeper is awful, I will come to later, when it inevitably fucks up, because Minesweeper is a puzzle game that you can lose. It's a puzzle game that sometimes just gives up on the pretense of being a puzzle game and just goes, fucking guess! Guess, you bitch! It's awful. Anyway, right. There's one here, there's three here. That means that this has to be one. Completely useless to us for now, but that's the thing. One here, one here. So one bomb in that area, one bomb in that area. Uh, two bombs in that area, but it's an extra one because we know of that one. Which means that that one, not a bomb, but there's four there. So that's slightly irritating. Uh, two in that area, I'm going to guess, because screw this game. It is a game that you just have to guess. Just lots of guessing and clicking and clicking and guessing. I play this game far too much for someone who doesn't like it, but I do that with a lot of games I don't like. I don't know why. Maybe I just hate myself. Uh, let's open up uh, a nice chunk of this. As you can see now, I just you just gradually work your way, and the patterns and the numbers all blur into a, a horrible dance of death. Um... <laughs> I'm being seriously negative right now. Uh, that one. Ah! No! I tried to guess. I tried to guess because uh, guessing is one of the main mechanics of this game. And for some reason it punishes you for guessing. It really is. I mean, you will get to scenarios where you just can't win. There's just no way of knowing what's next. And there is... There's just no way of getting out of that. It's... I mean, this is the Microsoft one. I'm assuming that someone has made a version of this game that doesn't do that. I mean, what other puzzle games have, like guesswork. I mean, could you imagine if you had a crossword and you opened it up and it was like, five down. What I had for breakfast this morning. Uh, who the fuck are you? I don't know. <laughs> what am I thinking of right now? Or just the word guess with just a happy face. Uh, I don't know. It was marmalade. Uh, that answered all the questions, actually. Uh, so yes, it's 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 like a word search that I just don't tell you what's in it. And there's no letters, and the word search is painted on someone's house. I don't know what that means, but Nerd Cubed out of context just high-fived himself. Tell him just fuck that one up and start a new one. Nobody saw that. Nobody will ever see that. <laughs> uh, oh, crap, come on. So you may be thinking, why did Microsoft include this with every single thing? I, I think it's just a way of them being able to teach you the click controls. Like left-clicking and right-clicking together and, right, you know, right-clicking doing different stuff. I think it's more of a sort of tutorial kind of thing. The downside is that it's so... The, the, the rules are just so... No one really knows them. So no one ever plays it. So it's an absolutely awful tutorial. It's like, this is going to teach you how to click. Oh, good. What's everything do? Work it out for yourself. Well, why don't I just work out clicking for myself? Shut up. We're Microsoft. We know everything. Now buy our Surface Pro tablets that no one else is buying. I'm a huge Microsoft fan. Um, <laughs> uh, 
Uh, yes. Okay, right. Clicky, all the things, and then... Now where do we go? I do like... I do like it. When this game is a puzzle game, it's great. Because you have to genuinely, like, think about stuff. So that was... See, that was one there, but then there was three there. So that means we're going to gain one there. You know, when, when you're actually having to think about stuff and stop and try and break it down, it's quite good. But when it's just guesswork... Uh, it's horrible. Right, three there, so only one of those, which means that those three are all bombs. Did you get- did you follow that? Three there, so in this square here we have three, two of which are there, so only one of these is bombs. That needs four, so only one of these being bombs, it needs another three, that's these three there. That's how you can dig stuff out. See, stuff like that is brilliant. As, as a puzzle, far puzzle games go, that's great fun. Ah, fuck! This is another- this is a corner of death, isn't it? Yep, yeah, okay. Alright, we have, uh, one- See, the best thing to do is, look, so I always leave those bits to the end, because then you know how many bombs you're dealing with in that area. Although it should be uh, two bombs in that area, I think. Because that needs five. Hang on, let's see if we can work this out. That needs five. So, see, the thing is, I don't know sometimes if I can work it out, or if it's just going to be a corner of death and there's just no way of failing. So that needs five. So there's two bombs in this area here. So in these things here, there's two bombs. Uh, this needs two, so in here there's two bombs. This needs one, so in here there's one. So one of these two is not a bomb. Which means that the two bombs should technically be these two. Oh no, because there's one there, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, do this again. It's, it's kind of trying to shift that idea that you can't complete this is really annoying. Like, when you know information about stuff, like, it, it makes you, ch it changes your decision-making skills and stuff. It's like, it's like if, if, for instance, say something like, um, uh, you're playing, say, Mass Effect or something. Say, some sort of Mass Effect style game. And you know at some point people might die. So you start pick, but you only do that from the, like, in the first game, you didn't know your decisions could kill people. So you'd accidentally kill people by doing stuff. In the second game, you'd be looking out for things. You wouldn't be deciding, is this what I would do? Is this not what I'd do? You'd be thinking, who would die if I do these things? So you start thinking about things differently if you know more information. And for a puzzle game, that's a complete killer. Also for Mass Effect. But we won't talk about that now. Wait, one there, two there. Digging it out, two there. Digging it out. Whoa, 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 whoa. They actually changed this game. There was a huge petition in... I can't remember what it was. It was like 2001 or something. People got really pissed off at Minesweeper. I know. Of all the games to cause controversy, Minesweeper was one of them. Um, because apparently it was really offensive to people who do this for a living. Because mm. this is an accurate representation of minesweeping in war scenarios. I see. I, I really doubt they dig something up and go, Oh, am I going to explode? Oh, it's a five! I, I don't think that's that's how that works, to be perfectly honest. It's kind of... It's like getting annoyed at Furbies and going like, No, Furbies are evil because, you know, you can't turn real pets off. That doesn't make much sense, so don't think about it too hard. Ones. Ones are so delicious. A one just means like, hey, come over here, there's no mines. You can just play around and do whatever the hell you want. Whoops, I made a question mark. Uh, the question marks, if you're unsure about stuff, you can stick down a question mark. That's just so you don't click it. It's just so you remember you're unsure, as far as I can tell. I've never actually read the instructions. Ah, piss nuggets. Oh, no, that's fine. Oh, Jesus. Uh, <laughs> see, it's, it's just that, it's that mentality. This, I, I, the, the, just a huge psychological experiment is, is Minesweeper. You never know if you're going to driven safe. See, the problem is now I've told you that you can't win it sometimes. It's You're just going to go mad. It's going to just ruin you. Just knowing that information will destroy your soul every time you play this game. I've ruined Minesweep for you. And to be perfectly honest, that's a good thing. Because it's just, it's sometimes a dick. That's all it really is. <laughs> uh, five along there. Oh, no question marks. We have no... Oh, yeah, that is one. Good. Thank you for misclicking the hand. I found a small hole and so I climbed into it as if I was some sort of potholer. Or, um, I don't know, mouse, I suppose. <laughs> Things that core into small holes. Uh, mouse, I'd be awful on, like, Family Fortunes, or whatever it's called in America, where it's like, the, it's, you get the 100 people said, and then at the end, they have to sort of, like, name things. It's like, name something that's black. I'd be like, ah, my mood. I don't know. I can't think that quickly about stuff. Um, <laughs> as I just proved that by saying the phrase, about stuff. Come on, let's finish. I might actually be able to finish a level and show that I don't suck. At uh, Minecraft Sweeper. Minecraft Sweeper is an entirely different game. Uh, ah, fuck. Come on, four there. There's, so, so there's one in that slot, two in that slot, one in there, two in there. But I don't know how many mines there are, so it's almost useless information. Uh, two up here, so one of these isn't a bomb. There's three here, so one of these isn't either. And two here. So if it's that one, then it's that. Okay, good. That was guesswork, but it worked, so yay. Uh, guess! Ah! So close! Damn you! Right, uh, did you know Minesweeper is banned 
in uh, all the government places. Minesweeper is not allowed because it makes people so angry they could start wars. So they don't allow it. Which is which is quite um, a lie. Yes. Okay, small area cleared out. Let's go for these twos over here. Uh, before before any of you get it, this idea in your head, I'm not doing any Minesweeper challenges. All right? No Minesweeper challenges here. Not something I'm going to do at all. Uh, I don't want to play this game more than I do, which is an extortionately large amount. Uh, ah, just so satisfying to dig everything out. I, this is basically, at some point, Peter Molyneux saw this and thought, that would be a great mobile game if people could draw penises with it. And he was wrong. Oh, hello. I'm getting near the end of this one now. Uh, it's looking quite good so far. Nothing particularly evil. I know there's a whole side over there I haven't touched yet, but shh. We don't think about the other side. We think about one side at a time. You have to caress Minesweeper puzzles into not glitching and just being dicks to you. Uh, one here and one here. So that's not one. Uh, so that's most likely to be one. No one there. One I was trying to click. I hate my sausage hands! One here, two here. That means there's one here. Um, one here, one here. Well, that's just completely whatever. Guess! Wrong! One more go! Nice, right, okay. This is this is it now. It's the final go. I'm misclicking everywhere. God damn, it's this stupid mouse that I've got. That's right, I'm a bad workman. I'm blaming my tools. Oh shit, this got weird. Nope, three because of that one there. Thank you, that one there. Woo, I got a doo doo. I feel like I've achieved something. I've leveled up my skills. Uh, you do not level up Minesweeper skills. You have zero and you're gonna like it. Right, clicky, and done that corner. Nice. When you getting corners is quite terrifying because this is the advanced difficulty. Ooh, I'm so f f swish. Um, <laughs> can't think of a word. I'm like, what's a word for good? I've never used it for myself before. One of these is a bomb. One of them is a bomb. One of them is a bomb. One of them is a bomb. <laughs> Christ. Uh, oh, I've misclicked that bloody thing there. One of them is a bomb, and also one of them is a bomb, and also one of them is a bomb. One of them is a bomb. Two of them are bombs. And two of them are bombs. So that means that that could be right. But if there's more bombs than I think there are, that would have exploded. Thank goodness it didn't. Right, now we can start digging that area out. Yeah, there's a little bit of guesswork there. Um, there may be super special, awesome mathematical ways of working things out. But um, ain't nobody got time for that, as the internet so fervently says. One bomb here. One bomb here. Don't know how many bombs there are left. Twelve bombs left. Uh, one bomb here. Two bombs here. One bomb here, and one bomb here. Hmm, one bomb here as well. See, the problem is I don't know, because it's too too big of an area. I may have to do a, a guess. Oh, thank God. Right, okay. <laughs> In the comments, explain to me exactly how I could have worked out that. Oh my God, I might actually be able to finish a level. Whoops, that one there. This is going to be the best day ever. I've proved it. I will be the first person to ever complete a level on the internet. Yay! I did it. I finished Minesweeper. <sighs> so yeah, that's Minesweeper. It's now telling me that I've won a million games. <laughs> My win percentage totally isn't 4%. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching Procrastinators and ta-ra. Let's have one more quick go. Uh, there! Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like bird poo. Enter the domain of the nerd cube. Videos dropping from above like bird poo.